Now don't tap the glass, Renny. Pickle doesn't like that very much. Okay, Grandpa. What do you think he's thinking about? Mm, by the looks of it, he wants some clean water. What do you say, Franny? Should we change Pickle's water? Yeah! Okay, you watch Pickle, and I'm going to get a big bucket of water. No, Grandpa. I want to get the water. I want to do it. <laughs> but don't you want some help from your old Grandpa? <laughs> And how do you do? What can we do for you this fine afternoon? It's my flippers, you see. I was swimming in the ocean this morning when I realized they were broken. Ooh, in the ocean? Let's have a look. I think it's the flip. It's a little floppy. A floppy flip, you say? Shouldn't be too difficult. I'll have them ready for you by Friday. Franny? Into the fix-it box they go! <laughs> Where will my feet take me today? possible. I was here with all my uncles and cousins and brothers and sisters looking at this fascinating reef and then I wondered what was under all the rocks around here and when I looked up they were all gone. I see. Say, I could help you find your family. I saw which way they went. No thank you. I'll find them myself I'm sure. I know how you feel. I was just telling my grandpa how I like to do stuff myself. Fascinating. What kind of fish is this, Grandpa? He's not a fish. He's a shoe repairman. Fascinating. Truly. I'd love to hear more about this Grandpa of yours, but I'd better go. Must be this way. Or this way? I think I could use your help. I'm a little lost. Flippity flippers, we've got to help Gus find his family. Come on. So tell me all about land living with Grandpa. Well, he takes shoes with holes in them, or shoes that are torn, or shoes that are really, really dirty. Fascinating. He fixes them all up. I follow you. One question. Uh-huh. What are shoes? <sighs> I'd better start at the top. <laughs> Look! There's an octopus! Maybe he saw them. Let's ask. <laughs> Excuse me, Mr. Octopus. Have you seen Gus's family? I don't think he has any idea where they are. I agree. Thank you, Mr. Octopus. We'll try to find Gus's family working together. <laughs> Clue. Your family must have left it for you. Little Ed 
Edna must have drawn it. She's very artistic. Fascinating. It's a picture of me with an arrow that points at you. What could it mean? I don't think it's pointing at me, Gus. I think it's pointing the way. Really? Well, then let's go. What are you waiting for? There they are! Let's go! Why are you slowing down? Why aren't you slowing down? Huh? Did you notice something funny? We're going backwards! Yes! <laughs> Trying to take a nap. You swallowed my friend! What? I never! It's okay. I'm all right. But it's very dark and smelly. What have you done? Gus! Gus! Oh, poor Gus! Really? I'm all right. Oh, how terribly embarrassing. I'm so sorry. Try talking through my blowhole. You'll hear him better. Right. Hang on, Gus. I'm coming. I'm not going anywhere. Gus, can you hear me? Indeed, I can. I've got good and bad news. What's the good news? I can still see your family. What's the bad news? You're stuck inside a whale. Wait a second. Maybe you can escape through the blowhole. Hey, Mr. Whale, do you think you could tilt over so Gus can swim out safely? Well, I can do better than that. Get ready. I'm going to blow. Okay. Aim that way. Everybody. Yes. This is Franny. Hello. Hiya. Yay! Thanks, Franny. I'm happy I asked you for help when I needed it. If it wasn't for you, I might be whale food by now. No problem. I've got to go now. Thanks for helping me, Franny. You're welcome. Bye. Try not to get lost again. Are you going to finish changing pickles, Walter, Franny? Yes, but can you help me, Grandpa? But I thought you wanted to do it on your own. Nuh-uh. Maybe when I'm bigger. But for just now, I need help. Like Gus. Gus? Who's Gus? A little fish who lost his way. He thought he could find his family by himself. But he needed help, so I helped him. That was nice of you. Mm -hmm. And I'd be happy to help you fill Pickle's bowl. <laughs> Where will my feet take me tomorrow?